Hey guys, today I, we were gonna, we're gonna do something very really cool. Top five things to do with magnets. Let's get started. First, we can do, we can get two magnet balls here. See this? It's so good with like this here. And then, what we're gonna have to do, we have to take a ring. Anything that's shaped like a ring, right? Even you can even use your finger. Or a pot, whatever you call these things. Like, these kind of stuff. Or this. You can use anything you want. You take the two magnet balls right here. You put it, you put them on the table, if you want to put them, just stay them right there, just put them there, and stay still, then you just poke it in there, and then, what you're going to do, you're going to take a thing with you, you're going to poke it, where is it? You ask. It's actually like, down here. You can use this as a slingshot. So, like, shoot up here. Try and shoot it at. Just push this. Slingshot. Alright, number four is you can take a war ball, open it, take one um, ball. Put it in here. Take the other ball, put it there. You can press some people by doing this. Now you cannot take it off. As you can see, it's very cool. Then don't let people find out that there's no people moving. And, and you can show them there is this here, this there. So obviously, it's going to be a reaction. Um, one thing else I like to do with magnets. All right, so you go, you can go to anything. Like it's sort of like the last trick. For example, let's use this. All right, you can use this to pot. Put it here. Where is it? There we go. Put it here. Boom, it's floating. The trick is... Oh god, wait, sorry. And like, it has to have some sort of black line. Wait, one second. The camera's a bit... There we go. Anyway, it needs to have a, a kind of like line to show. But then, what you do, you have to hide it. To hide the ball. Boom, it also looks like it's a flying ball. Which I think is pretty cool. Number three. I mean, uh, sorry. Number four. Uh, yeah, actually, number three. Sorry. What you can do is for this, you need a whole road of these magnet balls. Like this. Supposed to, supposed to do, you take like about this much, then you split it in half. Only way you can split it in half if you make this and this, and then split that too. Oh. And then now it's like split into two. Now you're just supposed to take two edges, boom, and put your nail stick in there. And then now, like you got this pattern, you just take it out, and now you have half. What you're supposed to do next, make this into an X, you fold it, it looks like this. 
for it like that. And this kind of makes a cool pattern, which I think is pretty cool. So if you ever want to do kind of like, it's just really cool. I mean, like when you actually see, when you look at a camera, it's not that cool, but when you see like this, it's actually really cool. I think this is the fifth one. Yeah, I think this is the fifth one. We need it's a coin. Okay, coin, beautiful coin right here. Then, well, okay, this is just a bonus one, but. Yeah, okay, this is not the flag, that's a trick. What you now have to do, you need to take four of these magma balls. Four. Okay. Take, split those two into two. Oh god, wait, sorry. Split those into two. Then you take, you put it here, you put one there. You can trick people, you can bet people on this, like you can tell them, if I move this one, will the whole thing move? And if they say yes, that's right, you just want to bet right there. So then like, you can bet for money, you can bet for anything, you can bet for Pokemon, anything. This won't move, so you can bet people if this will move or not, and you'll know if it moves. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Click that like button and subscribe.